Well, good morning. It's been a little while since I put anything on YouTube, so I thought maybe I'd put a little quick thing on this morning. You know what it's like sometimes when you have a, a irregular shaped piece of wood that you are trying to put through the through the router on the router table and uh, so you grab your feather board and you look at it and you think hmm how's it going to work so I've got a little idea here that I'm going to show you it's very simple and uh, this takes some scrap wood and you can make a couple of feather boards out of it and then you fasten it together with a couple of uh, quarter inch bolts and voila you have an adjustable feather board that works very well for odd shaped pieces of wood. Now what I want to do is to put a rabbit on the back side of this with my router table and you can see I've already got an irregular shape set up. This is just a scrap of wood I'm using for illustration. So the way that I accomplished holding this in place, because it's tall and rather wobbly and hard to hold against the fence in such a way that it'll, it'll uh, stay in position, I've put this together and uh, it's really pretty simple. Uh, all I've done is get these wing nuts off of here so you can see what I've done. Okay, my first piece, I've just got two quarter inch bolts in it on my, my first feather board. And I've countersunk the, the backs of them. Uh, they have uh, carriage bolt heads on them. So I countersunk it in so that there will be no problem clamping it down tight. The second piece, uh, second uh, feather board, as you can see I have slotted here for the bolts so that this can slide back and forth on the two bolts that are in number one feather board and that way I can move it to whatever position I need to in order to uh, accommodate the irregular side that we have on this board that we're going to work on. Uh, sometimes when you're doing picture frames and things like that, why you run into something that's really throws you for a loop. You don't know exactly what to do. The other thing is that I have made a spacer, and this happens to be about three quarters of an inch thick. Well, it's supposed to go on there. Yeah, there it goes. And then the second one, of course, can go on top like so. I don't have long enough bolts in here right now to do the job, but you can see that we can accommodate a, a pretty tall uh, picture frame profile and still accommodate uh, holding the picture frame in place. And uh, this is I think is going to work out really well for really odd shaped oddball things. So without any further ado, I think that'll be it for this week and I hope all is going well for you this fall. We're having a nice cool fall here in the Willamette Valley and anyway I wish, wish God's blessing on you, and we'll see you in a, another week, hopefully.